The latest feature in Yandere Simulator is the ability to join clubs and gain a benefit from those clubs. In a future video, I will introduce all of the clubs that are going to be in the game and explain all of the benefits that they will grant. In this video, I will simply explain how clubs operate. To join a club, you must speak to the club's leader. A club leader can be identified by the red armband on their left arm. When speaking to a club leader, you will have the option to ask them to describe their club to you. Welcome to the Martial Arts Club. What brings you here? We study hand-to-hand -hand combat and practice self-defense techniques. If you join our club, I guarantee that you'll be able to defend yourself from anyone that might try to hurt you. If you think you've got what it takes, you're welcome to spar with any of our members at any time, even if you're not in the club. If you still don't understand exactly what the club's benefit is supposed to be, ask to join the club and the benefit will be spelled out for you. Interested in joining the club? All we ask is that you show up at least once a week. If players report that a club's benefit is too strong, I will reduce the strength of that benefit in future updates. Fantastic! You are now an official member of the Martial Arts Club. I'm looking forward to teaching you everything I know. Some clubs will have a special uniform associated with them. If a club has a changing booth, and you are a member of that club, you can use the booth to change into that club's uniform. It's possible that, for some clubs, the club's benefit might not activate unless you are wearing that club's uniform. You can only be a member of one club at a time. If you try to join another club, the leader of that club will not accept you. Um, hi. Um, you can't be in two clubs at once. I'm sorry. Quitting a club is a very simple process. Welcome to the Martial Arts Club! Are you thinking of leaving the club? That's a shame. I'm sorry to see you go. You're still welcome to spar with us anytime you'd like. If you quit a club, you will not be allowed to join that club again. Welcome to the Martial Arts Club! I'm sorry. I've discussed it with the rest of the club, and we decided that if someone quits the club, they cannot be allowed to join again. I hope you understand. Club benefits can be very strong. However, you will lose a club's benefits permanently if you quit the club or get kicked out. In order to avoid getting kicked out of a club, you must participate in that club's activity at least once per week. You can participate in a club activity by speaking to the club leader and selecting activity. A club activity occurs between 5 and 5.30. If you attempt to participate in a club activity too early, the club leader will tell you so. Welcome to the Martial Arts Club. We're not quite ready for club activities just yet. Come back any time between 5 and 5.30. If you attempt to participate in a club activity too late, the club leader will tell you so. Welcome to the Martial Arts Club. I'm sorry, you were late so we started without you. Try to make it here before 5.30 next time. Welcome to the Martial Arts Club. Ready to start training? The school day will end after participating in a club activity. In other words, participating in a club activity means that you're sacrificing the rest of the school day in order to retain the benefit that the club grants you. Excellent! Let's begin! Defeat is a state of mind. No one is ever defeated until defeat has been accepted as a reality. Some clubs might have a special function that you can use regardless of whether or not you're a member of that club. But this feature is not functioning yet. There are several circumstances that could prevent you from being able to join a club. For example, If you commit murder in front of a club leader, that club leader will never let you join their club. You can't be here. 
Your aura is too dark. You will attract evil spirits. I'm sorry. Please leave. If you commit murder in front of a club member, <laughs> but you dispose of the evidence and get away with your crime, that club member will still remember what they saw. They will tell their leader about you, and you will not be allowed to join their club. Um, hi. I'm sorry. One of our members believes that you may be possessed by a demon. I can't allow you to join this club. Please, don't hurt me, demon. If you commit murder in front of a club member, <coughs> while you are a member of that club, they will tell their leader all about you, and you'll be kicked out of the club the next time you speak to the club leader. Um, I'm sorry. You can't be a member of this club anymore. You're too scary. Huh. That's ironic. Being kicked out of a club about scary things for being too scary. Once you've made an enemy out of one of your own club members, you cannot avoid being kicked out of the club. Even if you avoid speaking directly to the club leader, you will still be kicked out of the club via text message at the end of the day. If you commit murder in front of your club's leader, they will, of course, kick you out of the club. If the club leader is the type of person who runs away after witnessing murder, they will kick you out of the club via text message instead of telling you in person. If you kill a club leader, the club will close. If you kill off club members until less than five people remain in the club, the club will close. When a club closes, it is gone forever, and your ability to use that club's benefit is gone forever. In the final game, it is possible that over 50% of students may be members of a club. In other words, if you kill someone, you might be locking yourself out of a club benefit permanently. Be very careful who you kill. By the way, a student who has witnessed Yandere-chan commit murder on a previous day will now refuse to speak to Yandere-chan in the future. Don't talk to me. I know you killed someone. I'll make sure everyone knows what you've done. A student like this will damage Yandere-chan's reputation on all subsequent days. If Yandere-chan's reputation drops to negative 100 or less, Senpai will hear all about her true nature, and it will become impossible for Senpai to love her. There is only one way to stop a student who holds a grudge against you. There are several other things that I've added to this build, but instead of telling you about them, I think it would be more fun to let you discover those things on your own. I know what features I want to work on next, but I don't want to make any promises, since I'm not sure how long it will take for me to get those features working. My next video might be about the future of Yandere Simulator, rather than be about a new feature. Thank you for following the development of Yandere Simulator.